guys, Ian from Eurogamer back again with another Let's Play. This time I'm going to be giving you a preview of Serious Sam Double D XXL, which is due out on the Xbox Live Arcade on February the 20th. So, uh, got about a month to wait for this, just under a month to wait for this, uh, to hit home consoles. Now, Serious Sam Double D XXL is a kind of... Uh, it follows on from Serious Sam Double D, which was released on Steam, and uh, it's the same game just with added extras. And there's uh, there's two, well, there's like basically one main uh, extra, large extra point, and that is the addition of drop in, drop out co-op. Um, which I'll demonstrate to you in a second. There's challenges, head-to-heads, arenas, and secrets and stuff, uh, but I'm gonna jump straight in with the game, uh, start the game fresh, and start uh, with uh, Serious Sam. Here we go. Now it's a uh, 2D shooter, it's not first person like normal Serious Sam games. Uh, press A to continue. Sam, there's a beacon somewhere in the vicinity. Whoa! When did you get so hot in the Trixa? You mean this body? It's a hologram, allowing you to visualize my AI. It's not real. But it is hot! Try to stay focused, Sam. You need to find the enemy beacon in ancient Egypt and shut it down. So, as you can see, it's full of the uh, normal Serious Sam style sexist dumbass humor. Uh, but yeah, it's 2D this time, and uh, from first looks, it's pretty. It looks like a game you'd find on Newgrounds.com or something like that. It's definitely not the best graphics. They have had an upgrade since its release on Steam. Um, nice, found a secret already. Ah. Um, in general, it's. Kind of generic 2D uh, shooter, but there are some crazy uh, twists that make it a bit more serious Sam in nature, which uh, I'll be uh, demonstrating to you as we go along. Uh, first up, I want to show you the co-op mode. It's drop in, drop out, local co-op. Uh, here we go. I've just uh, pressed A to uh, let the second player jump in. The second player is uh, Pete Huffington or Huff. He is uh, the star of the Serious Sam Double D trailer and the Serious Sam Double D XXL trailer. Uh, he controls exactly the same as Sam. You can do everything you can do with him um, as normal, but if you replay the game with him once you complete it, uh, you get a whole different kind of story, uh, conversation arcs with Natrixa and all that kind of stuff. But uh, yeah, I don't have any friends, so... Um to play with me, so I'm just going to have to get rid of uh, Huff and carry on with Sam. So here we go. First level set Speak in ancient Sam. Egypt. These enemies can teleport out of nowhere. Yeah, I know. They always do that. Okay. Well, my programmers wanted me to remind you that instant enemy spawning is totally acceptable. That's the way things are supposed to work. Trixie, are you glitching out again? So yeah, so this most serious Sam games, I think pretty much all of them are set in ancient Egypt, so this one's um, follows suit. It's made by a different team though, it's made by a company called Mommy's Best Games, uh, rather than Crow Team. Crow Team licensed out the IP. And uh, Serious Sam Double D was kind of like a, uh, a placeholder, something to play around with while you waited for Serious Sam uh, 3 BFE before First Encounter. Uh, Take that. So the moment, it's your simple All right. left to right How scrolling shooter. This big door? There seems to be no key, but rather a floor switch that you'll need to stand on briefly. Well, it's a good thing I had a full breakfast. <laughs> uh. I've, I've got to say, I used to be a massive fan of Serious Sam. Uh, when it first came out on the Xbox, the original Xbox, that was when I first played it, and I, I loved it. I thought it was hilarious. As time has gone by, the gameplay mechanics didn't really change, um, and now I'm kind of, to be honest, I'm a bit tired of the uh, the formula. Serious Sam, uh, Battle 4, uh, before first encounter, kind of did kind of bore me a bit. It's just same odd, same odd. Uh, I like that you've got instant quick save options. 
Uh, and it's the same kind of gameplay mechanics here. You just shoot things. There's no reloading. You just shoot until your gun runs out of ammo. These points here are, are quick save points. They act to something different a little bit later on. I hate these stupid horses. Uh, in the in, in the uh, first person shooter game, in the first person versions of the game, either they're not as bad in the 2D version. <laughs> Those aren't fortune cookies. Nice, a little uh, Temple of Doom in joke there. Serious Sam is uh, full of uh, crazy little in jokes, which is always uh, it's always cool. I love in jokes in my games. But this first level really does it. Starts off pretty slow, gets you to grips with the controls. There you go. And some trigger mechanics and stuff. Things don't really start picking up until a little bit later on. What the hell is that, man? Oh my god! It's a huge beetle. Uh, these are the first kind of new enemies that Mummy's Best Games have uh, added to the series. These are called uh, Chimputees. And these are normal chimps that have had uh, their arms and legs amputated, jetpacks fitted, and um, uh, banana guns, and I think axes attached to their uh, arms. These chests are hidden. Uh, these green things are current uh, the currency. Sam can buy extra weapons and upgrades from uh, from the, uh, the, the the shop, which appears at certain points of the game. And as per usual with Secret Sam games, there are plenty of hidden secrets, traps, extras, and uh, wah! I love the headless kamikazes. They're amazing. The first time I played. Um, Serious Sam. I didn't know they were coming, and you heard this kind of like distant scream, and then all of a sudden, over a hill, about 20 of these guys appeared. Uh, I laughed out loud. It was hilarious. I loved it. Not so much of a surprise now, though. There we go. Took down that robotic walking thingy. MBG, Mummy's Best Games. I've unlocked the. The Narmageddon Challenge. Uh, so the, uh, you unlock the challenge rooms as you go. And challenge rooms basically consist of kill certain things in a certain time. Ah! Oh! I've unlocked the Tommy gun now, so... Getting a bit better. Ah! Oh, that armoured Nar there, uh, I think, as far as I can tell, is a new enemy. There are a few new enemies added to the game. Uh, I don't know how many we'll see uh, added to this version of the game, should I say. The uh, the Chimputees were in the um, were in the uh, Steam version of the game, but the uh, Armored Nars are new for the XXL version of the game. Here we go. The Trader. Welcome, himself. stranger. Welcome, stranger. Another Let's in joke there. That gun, shall we? A little uh, nod to uh, Resident Evil 4 there. What are you selling? Uh, I've got the money. I can buy an air buffer, so I might as well buy an air, buff air buffer. This will re replace my um, Tommy gun, I do believe. So now with my air buffer, if I shoot, oh no, uh, can I change through my weapons? Okay, yeah, my air buffer now is a gun that, if I shoot, it slowly glides me down. And here we go. Uh, I've got my gun stacker. Now this is the big, kind of this big kind of unique cell for uh, Serious Sam Double D XXL. It's the gun stacker. You can stack guns on top of each other. You can have up to six weapons stacked up. Uh, it looks quite crazy when you've got all six guns uh, stacked up. Uh, and you have to unlock connectors and guns to. Uh, stack them up, but if we look here, I've got three separate guns uh, So I might as well stack the air buffer with the Tommy gun. I can't stack any more But now if I exit out 
uh, you can see it's quite far away, it's not zoomed in, but I now have a shotgun and a Tommy gun uh, air buffer together, so I've got long range and close range capabilities. Oh, there's another gun stacker there, so let's edit gun stacks and add another Tommy gun to the proceedings. So we've got air buffer, shotgun and Tommy gun. There we go, now I've got three guns stacked up. And uh, it looks like I'm going to have to uh, test it out in this little arena. Didn't I just kill you? Ah. It's got that constant stream of enemies and fountains of blood that you'd expect from a serious Sam game. Jumping around is easy enough. It takes a little while to get used to. They use the left trigger to jump here because you um, use the right stick to aim. Uh, it takes a little while to get used to. I kept uh, expecting A to jump when in fact A does not really do anything. There we go. Yeah. Singing along. What's going on here? Uh-oh. Ooh, unlucky for you. Okay, there we go. Should be able to take this blue bugger down a little bit quicker than I did before. Oh, there's Chimpy Tees and the Headless Kamikazes as well. Yeah, I took him down. All thanks to my gun stacking abilities. Ah! Ah! Take that! Ah! Ah! You can also jump on top of enemies as well. Uh, that comes into play a lot later on in the game. This is a, only a preview of the first few levels at the moment. Beheaded squad leaders, report! Beheaded squad leaders assembled, sir! Roll call, beheaded rocketeer leader! Yes, sir! Beheaded firecracker? Yes, sir! Beheaded bomber? Present! Beheaded kamikaze? Beheaded kamikaze. Beheaded kamikaze. All right, where's the kamikaze squad leader? I think he, uh, exploded, sir! Damn it, that's the third one today. La 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 la. So that was Act 1 Egyptian Assault done. It did it in 7 minutes, 54 seconds. There are Xbox Live leaderboards. Uh, looks like I'm position 91. Um... Yeah, there's Xbox Live leaderboards. Um, there's no online play, though. You can't play co-op online. It's only local co-op. So it's pretty cool that you got jump in, jump out co-op. But, uh, yeah, no online. As you can see, uh, we're a little bit close up now, and Sam has got his stacker going on. Welcome, stranger. Oh, what are you selling? Uh, brr, brr, brr. I've only got $41, so I can't buy anything. But there's loads of different styles of guns to unlock. Uh, really crazy weapons. That There's a weapon that shoots hot butter for slipping up enemies. and as that one shoots ninja stars by the looks of things there. Temporal dilator shoots. Shots slow down enemies for a moment. So that's good. Sam, but I can't the first it. beacon <laughs> appears to be located on the far side of this pyramid. Perhaps we'll have a moment to search for treasure along the way. Why is it you ladies are always interested in raiding tombs for treasure? We ladies? Yeah, I knew this athletic girl once. A little too classy for my taste, but she had the nicest pair of... Please spare me the stories of your conquests, Sam. We have work to do. What? She had a nice pair of handguns. Sure, Sam. I'm sure if we search hard enough, we can find some nice guns for you to play with. Um, so yeah, it's, uh, the script has obviously been written by a 14-year-old boy. Um. Ah, ah, oh, that just took a load of damage off me. Let's go get that secret chainsaw. That is one long chainsaw. Um, I don't have an extra... Uh, connector yet, so I'm gonna have to remove something. Let's uh, slot it in there. Uh, remove my Tommy gun. So now I've got a chainsaw, a air buffer gun, and a shotgun. Woo! Yeah, chainsaws rule. 
Yeah, the, the script in uh, Serious Sam games shouldn't be taken too seriously. It's one of those games that you're, you're either going to love it or you're going to hate it. Or you're just going to be a little bit indifferent to it, I guess. It's definitely um, an acquired taste. And a lot of people might not appreciate the dumb humour. There we go, I've got a new gun stacker so I can uh, I can stick my, my Tommy gun back on now. Uh, right on the top, there we go. Four guns now. Woo! Guns, guns, and more guns! And uh, that silver thing I just chainsawed, you can only open them with chainsaws. They give you either health or shield upgrades. So, we're all good to go. Woo! I'm ready to cause some damage. You can jump through platforms like this uh, by holding down and pressing the jump button. There's another button to press. Shoot in! Stab myself. Ah, ah, take that, you bastards! Woo. You hurry up and die. Ah. Yeah. Tons of blood. You can actually turn the blood and gore off. It says so in the menus. Uh, so you don't. It says. Uh, so you don't uh, scar your children. But to be honest, playing a game of, about a muscle-bound, sex-pest idiot probably isn't the best thing for uh, young children to do anyway, so I'd probably just leave it and <laughs> not let them play let's it. Let's upgrade that gun, shall we? Yeah, let's upgrade that gun. Oh, I still don't have enough money. Damn it. Let's go, then. Edit gun stacks. So yeah, now these checkpoints will wah, let you edit gun stacks and quick save. Oh god, moving platforms. Used to hate those bastards in Mega Man. Right. Full ammo? Cool. Let's keep going. Oh. Oh damn it! I know what I gotta do now. Now I'm stuck in this. Screw you, chimp and chimpy tea. Right, I have to shoot that button, you see. Ah, stupid, dumb horse bastards. Oh, I died, damn it. It's okay. Unfortunately, the loading screens are a little bit longer than I would have liked. But the checkpoints are plentiful. There we go, that's better. Got through. And what's this? Another Tommy gun. So I've got three Tommy guns? No, two Tommy guns and an air buffer. But I need another connector before I can use that. So uh, using RB switches through your gun stacks as well. You can replay the game multiple times, so you can keep collecting weapons, keep finding secret passages, and keep adding to your gun stacks. Ah! Whoa, that was close. <laughs> oh dear. What was that I said about the game being written by a 14 year old boy? Where else would you find kamikaze, headless kamikaze, well, nine foot tall, headless, topless, naked kamikaze woman with breasts. Bombs for breasts. I mean, where else but a serious Sam game. Um, insane. But quite funny, I guess. And there we go, that was the second level done. Uh, in four minutes, 5.74 seconds. I'm allowed to uh, show off the first six levels, so if you guys fancy seeing me uh, carry on playing uh, Serious Sam Double D XXL up to the sixth, sixth mission, please do let me know in the comments below. Um, you'll get to see more gun stacking, newer weapons, and uh, a few more new enemies as we go along. So. Uh, 
yeah, make sure you subscribe to the channel by clicking the link that's just uh, popped up. Let us know what you think about the game in the comments below. Let me know if you want to see more Serious Sound Double D XXL Let's Play. And uh, yeah, I will see you in the next video. Thank you very much for watching and bye. Uh, let's just have a quick test. Blah! Yes, he does die on spikes. <laughs> Stupid game. <laughs>